x square uh, minus 4 can divide this one with x. So we need to find the value of a and b and also we need to find the third factor. So since x square 4 can divide it that means x plus 2 x minus 2. So applying remainder theorem we can write from this one f minus 2 will be 0. So that will be minus 2 cube plus a into minus 2 square minus 2b plus 20 and that will be 0 since it divides so minus 8 and then plus 4a minus 2b plus 20 that's equals to 0 so that's 4 uh, 4a minus 2b that will be minus 12 that is equation 1 Similarly, x minus 2 divides, so we can, we, this one should be also 0. So, 2 cube plus a 2 square plus 2b plus 20. So, that's 8 plus 4a plus 2b plus 20 or 4a plus 2b that equals to 0. Or 4a plus 2b min is equal to minus 28. That is equation 2. So, if we add equation 1 and 2, we get 8a, 2b, uh, minus 2b and plus 2b gets cancelled and then we get here uh, minus 40, so a is minus 5 and we get b from uh, maybe here, so 2b is minus 4a minus 28 or minus 4 into minus 5 that's minus 20 minus 28 and minus 4 into minus 5 that's plus 20 actually so 2b there is equal to minus 8 and b is minus 4 so we have a and b a minus 5 and b minus 4 now we need to find the third factor and in order to do that we have just to uh, use trial and error so our uh, quantity now becomes x cube um, x cube minus 5 x square minus 4 uh, x b is 4 plus 20 this is the quantity and we know that x plus 2 x minus 2 divides so we can try uh, if x plus 1 is the third factor so in order to check that we have to see if f minus 1 becomes 0 so that is there 5 minus 1 square minus 4 into minus 1 plus 20 so that's minus 1 minus 5 plus 4 plus 20 so we can see that this is not 0 we don't need to calculate then we can try this one f1 and this is 1 cube uh, minus 5 minus 4 plus 20 and this one is also not 0 so this is also not a factor then we plus 2 minus 2 is a factor so then we can try this one uh, minus 3 and that will be x cube minus 5 into minus 3 square minus 4 into 3 plus 20 so that's uh, that's 3 cubes sorry 27 there minus 5 and 3 square is 9 so minus uh, 45 there minus 12 there plus 20 so that's also not 0 and then we can try x minus 3 that will be 3 there and this 3 cube that was minus 3 that was actually sorry this one was minus so this was negative and this one would have been negative as well that would have resulted uh, plus 12 there but this is not going 0 anyway so this is 3 so 3 cube minus 5 into 3 square minus 4 into 3 plus 20 so basically 27 and then now minus 45 as well because it's 3 square and then minus 12 plus 20 so this is also not 0 so this is also not a factor then we can try x minus 4 so f 4 there so that x cube 
minus 5 into 4 square minus 4 into 4 plus 20 so that's 4 cube that's 64 then 4 square is 16 and minus 80 minus 16 plus 20 that's not 0 we can tell and then x plus 4 whether that's a factor we can check so with minus 4 and this would be minus 4 cube 5 into minus 4 square minus 4 into minus 4 and then plus 20 that's minus 64 and then here again this is 80 minus 80 and then plus uh, 16 plus 20 this is also not 0 so this is also not a factor then we can try x minus 5 so we have to try with f5 there so that's 5 cube minus uh, 5 into 5 square minus 4 into 5 plus 20 so this is becoming 125 and this is 5 square is 25 times 5 minus 125 this is minus 20 and this is plus 20 finally we have a 0 this one this one getting cancelled this one this one so this is 0 so f5 is 0 that means x minus 5 is a factor that's the other factor uh, we have only uh, so this one x square minus 4 and this one this is the these are the factors because this is a third order polynomial so we will have only three of uh, because this one is already giving us x cube since the polynomial is of third order we will have only uh, one more factor and that one is uh, x minus 5